You wake up, you check Instagram, and you instantly feel poor. Does this sound familiar? It can feel like you're falling behind your friends financially when they seem to take nicer vacations and drive nicer cars. But the reality is, social media tends to hide a lot more than it shows. You don't see a Facebook post when someone misses a rent payment or carries a high interest credit card balance. Bottom line, you can't properly assess your financial health by looking at your Instagram feed. Here's how you can actually find out where you stand. If you have to compare yourself to someone, compare to the data of your peers at large. According to the Federal Reserve, the median income for families with a head of household around age 35 is a little more than $40,000. Half of those families carry a credit card balance with a median debt around $1,400. 42% have retirement accounts with a median value of $12,300. 45% have student loan debt, with a median debt of $18,500, although the amount varies widely based on income level and the type of degree. A much better way to think about your finances is to follow tried and true rules of thumb, rather than comparing yourself to your friends. Think about building an emergency fund of at least $500. You should eventually have three to six months of basic expenses saved there. While you're building that up, are you paying down high interest debt? Credit cards and personal loans should be the first debt you pay off heavily because the interest is traditionally much higher than student loans. What about retirement? If 10 to 15% of your pre-tax income every year for that. Most importantly, remember your financial situation is unique to you. Set aside whatever you can now. Don't wait until you can set aside that amount that you're supposed to save. If you can just save 1% for retirement, that's better than nothing. And maybe in six months, you can bump that up to 2%. When you look at your friends and see their fancy vacations or their expensive cars, remember, those things come with price tags. So do your research and figure out what your financial picture really looks like, not just what Facebook thinks. Mm -hmm.